Um, so this is a video about working out with no weights. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and comment if you have an opinion. I've been having been sober 15 years and working out and eating right is a big part of the struggle that I have. And uh, I don't like gyms. This is one of my friends, DDA, who's been in shape, probably the most in shape person I've ever met. He's used to be a model in Australia and he's talking about how we don't need weights. So enjoy basically communism right so the chinese didn't like the buddhists remember back back to what happened they tried to kill a dalai lama put the dalai lama in jail so when they created temples they also had people part of the temples who were warriors to protect the temples and those people created this thing called chi shen and uh, my old trainer was the only white guy to live with the with the monks for seven years and learn the way of chi shen the whole thing is using your own body weight to push against the ground because nothing is stronger than gravity so it'll, you, the harder you push against the ground, it's not going anywhere. It's always going to be the strength. So everything you do is full. Like when you do a handstand, it's trying to like break the ground. So like every movement you do is trying to push the ground as hard as possible. And they say like you pushing the ground will make you in stronger. And then it's meditation. So it's mind, body and soul. So like it's not about doing a handstand and like doing it like for like 10 reps it's like they they believe you have to do it a thousand times mm. and it's a discipline and you do the same exercises every day mm. and you become a master at that it's not switching up your body they believe becoming the master in the one thing but does that work out all your everything. muscles in your whole body dude everything that's crazy if you like hop on your hands and you pull your toes back and you lock out your elbows till you're completely tight and then walk on each hand. Your and then core. Do that, that everything. But what about your legs? Dude, quads, yeah, pull your, your quads are crushing. Whoa. Crushing. Can you do a handstand on the wall? Probably can, Yeah, right? you can. And then if, once you get, wall. once you get up on a wall, then start like thinking about your toes. Then start thinking about your legs, your stomach, think about your elbows. Cause a lot of people do a handstand. Mm. Once you, and then once you get that movement, then move. And but they, I mean, this dude used to lift dude, like weights. Yeah, weights. I don't you know what I mean? Like he was like, yeah, I mean, the most fit guy I've ever known. Yeah. Yeah, the weights thing just, yeah, it wasn't sustainable for me. Yeah. I really like the body weight stuff like, more. So good for you. Yeah. Oh, like you mean like in general and like push ups and sit ups and. Yeah, yeah, not trying to add like unnecessary bulk just no. for looks. It's like right. functional, functional movement and like move. yeah, exactly. just being more in touch with. The way my body moves and yeah. the purpose of it. I, I mean, I, and that's one thing this quarantine set off for me. Oh, yeah. Was like, oh, I'm just home, bust out the yoga mat, sit ups, oh, yeah. push ups, yoga. planks. Yeah, I've been hitting yoga. No, I mean, not, not necessarily yoga, um, but like just, you know, just stretches and, 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 and dips. And yeah. there's so many things you can do. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know, planks, side yeah. planks. There's so much like just unnecessary equipment at the gym. It's ridiculous. Like that, I, right. You just walk around, you're like, why are people using I'm this? Dude, it's... I'm canceling my gym membership. Oh, yeah. It's fucking dusted. Wow, I'm actually really glad you're saying that because I feel that same way. Yeah. I can get so much done by myself. Sit ups, pull ups, dips, and dips. That's... Side planks, planks, but side planks are handstands. Well, I'm saying then you get fancy bridges, that, right? like bridges. Well, what's a bridge? bridge is like the the best thing for your body. Like a bridge, like a, you know a bridge? Like, yeah, I mean. Like it's, you know what a bridge yeah, is, right? Bridge oh, you're not yeah. getting it to us? No. But you've been getting into Muay t or uh, Jiu Jitsu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't done that though since February. Wow. So I'm going to be like so bad when I get back. But are you, uh, what belt are you? I'm just a white belt. Oh, I mean, cool. that shit takes time. Yeah, I've yeah. Been, uh, doing it for like. Well, like, consistently for almost two years. Muay Thai is different than Jiu Jitsu or something? Yeah, Muay Thai is like kickboxing. And then jujitsu is all oh, yeah. grappling and submission. I've been thinking a, a lot about um, joining because there's some really good gyms around here. Oh yeah, Eddie this Bob. is the best place in the world for for jujitsu gyms. Mm. Yeah. Um, uh, and I've been thinking because a lot of like ex alcoholics, you know, sober alcoholics in recovery will will will, will get really into that. It's good it, discipline. Yeah, it's, I mean, but it's something you can get addicted to. You know, oh, and it's healthy sure, addiction. Sure. And my biggest struggle, yeah, my biggest struggle as an alcoholic in sobriety in recovery is eating good and, and staying in shape. It's my hardest 
working out. I don't like working well, out. Like if you could figure out something, yeah. Like I, additional to the stretching and all that, if you can figure out some hobby that you enjoy doing where you're like tricking yourself into cardio, like okay. if, if you can enjoy jujitsu, you can enjoy basketball, yeah, yeah. you can enjoy surfing. 100%. Like what, it, it's such a fucking... But even today, filming, running around, dude, holding that Ronin, filming, just constantly like, I, I end up work getting like, really, I was like sweating by the end of the day, you know, walking around. What a joy when I'm like, I'm like fucking bad, like I'm trying to paddle back out and there's a massive set coming and I'm just going yeah, super yeah. hard. And then I'm like laughing as I just barely make some wave. Yeah. And I'm just like, wow, I'm out of breath. I'm laughing. I'm like, I didn't, I like enjoyed that. Just and like, I'm just like, the next day you didn't really realize yeah. you were yeah. working out. I'm like, yeah. it's a lot of the same muscles. So I'm not like a sore if I don't right. for a while am, but yeah. it's just crazy that I'm like not, even paying attention when I'm doing crazy cardio. Yeah, my shit was just, Trick. my shit was just straight addiction. I was like, I don't like running at all, I don't know but how. my motivation to like get in shape was like the only thing that I enjoyed. And I just made something that I hated so much. And I just wow. became addicted to, I tried to create a discipline from it. But so many people enjoy become addicted to running now. That be, does become because it's a because di- once you find that discipline and rhythm and you le- and you learn to enjoy it. Like you learn, time. yeah, you learn to get like this mental clarity yeah. once you push past a certain point. Like how long? It's the first ten minutes to where you stop being a little bitch about it. You know, yeah. Yeah. Like, you first remember, ten I can minutes. Vaguely remember when like there was a time when I was running that like. You do hit a thing where you can kind of hit a pace just for a flow. long ass time, and it's not like right now. I'm like fucking hating it after. 10 well, not if you have fucking leg perthes. I had an operation on my hip, so my, my 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 bone came out of the socket. So when I run for longer than a mile, I start to feel it in my hip. My joints start to hurt for sure from running. But like I've been doing jump rope, just trying to build up the that's tendon. That's, that's jump rope is my bro. shit. Right yeah, now. me too. That's me too. Do. Yeah, we got two jump ropes right over there. I'm oh, yeah. obsessed. With three that minutes shit. is like no. Nah. Oh, yeah. You're like really going at three minutes. You can get your heart rate up quick. Three minutes you're is like, so hard. Jumping is like does it? Dude, jump well, rope. with your arms too, because your arms. Yeah, I don't know. It's weird. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's a whole thing. 30 minutes a day of that shit, I'm fucking toasted, yeah. bro. Yeah. I mean... 30 minutes of jump roping? Hold, hold, yeah. You know how hard it is to jump rope, right? Yeah, 30 minutes. You, you think you could do three minutes? Probably three minutes. You can't. <laughs> it's crazy. It's so hard. Where's the jump rope? It's right there. That, 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 that. 20 straight. 20 minutes straight? straight. Today. Dude. I, 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 I bet... Because I do round, so I have this interval I thing like, I, where like it, it does rounds, recall. right? Because I was really, usually doing it's three minutes really. One if you do three off, minutes straight, you're gonna be to the point, fucking like, okay, dying I'll tomorrow. Ten, I'll do dude, four like rounds. Just like a little you see that little, four, not the red one, but the other one. Dude, music. Like, I have like a Bluetooth, yeah, yeah, yeah. and I just kick it. Yeah. I just kick it. it. I'm thinking like, about something now. Different like flows and moving differently. Yeah, you get creative with it. I love just like a boring exercise. Yeah, yeah, dude. I've seen some fools do some crazy. Oh, dude. Yeah, I just crashed. She she just hit that video real quick. That that hit that. I can't find that. That She she sent because Veronica and and Didi have been working out. He has a gym under his house at the beach. Oh, I saw that on Instagram. Looks so cool. Oh, oh, you saw the beat the 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 gym. Yeah, you got pulled. Oh yeah. You yeah, it's cool. You so when you get it. back from Arkansas, are you going to come back to go back to Vegas? No clue what the plan is. Whoa. I'll probably, if, I mean, if I come back this way, I'll probably go to San Diego for a while. Because my sister has a house there. And right. A room and everything. All right. So we're jumping into it. No pun intended. Um, Tim is uh, at, let's see where he's at. He's, Tim's not, gonna, I'm not going to make it. Yeah. So, so Tim's at 50 seconds. I know it's crazy. It's a it's a really crazy thing. We are gonna make it. Why would you? Say it, it's it's a it? really or it's just scoot up to, uh, forward a little bit as you're yeah, moving. Just there. Yeah, so right there. Just stay in that one spot. So you don't get. Just breathe it out. You know? He's doing pretty good. Yeah, I, I, yeah, he is. And it's okay if you if you trip up. Just start again. He's not tripping. I'm just saying if oh, you yeah, 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 don't yeah. like let that stop your whole thing because it's still okay. just keep going. I just don't know if I want to be sore for surfing tomorrow. Yeah, so that's you know you're not you're halfway. 
Yeah, you're gonna be really sore, so you don't need to. Yes. Point prove it. It's crazy. Yeah. Dude, Nate was so stubborn, he did five minutes. Yeah, I'm almost tripped it up. Solid form though. <laughs> Got that 12 seconds. In the flops. He's crushing wow. in the flops though. I just hope my pants don't fall down. So these good. are like really heavy. You might need then to we, forward. Then we could just put, he's good. Probably more forward. You're getting close to those lights. Oh, he's doing the big hops too, huh? Because my pants though. Then we could put on OnlyFans. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. Harder than sandals? Yeah, I could. Um, you good? Got a minute? Fuck this. <laughs> tough. 111. It's a tough boy. It's hard out here. It's okay though. That's learning to lose.